What's up, fellas? Welcome to the Mold Tool Dakar Rally 2023. There's a lineup of Jeeps here about to head out into the Lost Quarter and uh, go to the bivouac, which is the pits where all the riders are. So there's a there's some. I just want to share with you guys these Jeeps, man, because there's some awesome looking rigs here that are all set up for going through the Sahara Desert. The original by Motul. It's a category for the motorbike, for the pilot without assistance. They have uh, one set of tires, one set of wheels, one tent, one sleeping bag, uh, and one mattress. We have a setup every day on the bivouac. They have at their disposition one big box of tools. Uh, they have all the motul oil for the motorbike. They have one compressor, they have generator, they have lights. Every day we make a setup making a, a huge garage in the middle of the desert. Like the uh, Jeep Sahara, the Jeep Gladiator. They're going out to the Lost Quarter. Look at, look at this thing. Just awesome. Wow. 37 by 12.5s on this one. Y'all are ready to go? Yeah, you have to. Excellent. <laughs> This guy's got the biggest tires on his, man. 40s. 40 by 13.5. Look at these. We got Fox shocks on them. Bead locker rims. Big giant worn winches on the front. There's some beautiful Jeeps, man. This blue one really caught my eye. I had to share this with you guys. Look at the color of this thing. Love the color of your Jeeps. Beautiful. Really nice. All-terrain TAs. That's a way to travel in the desert right there. Nice. Trail rated. Nice Rubicon. Ready to go. This is the 45th running of the Dakar Rally Raid. And these guys are going out to uh, have the ultimate Jeep experience on the dunes in the last quarter. 250,000 square miles. Oh, desert terrain. That's the one they have. Jeep Sahara. Somewhere in the area of 35 Jeeps about ready to head out in the sands. They got the tires aired down. Lockers engaged. Winches ready to go. Sand shovels in case they get in a pickle. Hey, we got a, a Ranger right here. 4x4 four four Ranger. one I'd have to have because you can put your motorcycle in the back. The Gladiator, ready to go. Put your bike in the back, right? Got the Cooper radials on there. Look at that. 315 70R17s. That is nice. We're hopping in the big Mercedes-Benz bus here to head out to the bivouac, which uh, is basically the pits. What do you think? Oh, man, I'm in complete straight on right now. Time to roll. So Motul chartered our own private bus right here. Talk about first class, you got the whole bus to yourself. Yeah. Had to get another view of this light blue Jeep right here. Check this thing out, man. The Fox factory shocks. Big Cooper Discoverer, 40 by 13.5s. The interior is beautiful. I love the orange interior, that looks beautiful. Is that factory original or is that all custom? It's coming from here. Really nice. Yeah, nice. Beautiful truck. Love the interior. Like really nice. That looks so cool. That's one badass Jeep right there. Look at the LED lights everywhere. Massive tires. Fox factory shocks. Boat reservoirs. Big brush guard. That's about as badass as it gets, man. That is cool. Very nice. I think I need one of these, man. I didn't know I needed one of these, but I do now. <laughs> That's the danger of going to these kind of events. So stay tuned, guys. We're heading to the bivouac to see all the 453 contestants 
and the Motul Dakar Rally 2023. Stay tuned, more great videos to come. So welcome to my uh, garage in the middle of the Saudi Arabian desert. Um, after a long day today, it's time to work on my machine. Um, I've done oil, oil filter, air filter, changed the tires, and yeah, it's uh, time for some food and bed in a minute, but have a look around. So come and check out the box. <laughs> so inside is just a bit of a few home comforts, a few notes I've made from home. So what the days are going to be like, what tires I'm going to change, when I'm going to change my oil, um, the distances I'm going to do that day. I've got a few oil filters, some specialist tools I might use, some energy bits which I tape onto the bike so I can uh, just use on the go. Yeah, box of air filters. It's just stuff to, to keep you and the bike going really. Yeah, that's uh, about it here in my desert garage. <laughs>